So here I am in an older version of Blender with an older version of Box Cutter so that way I can press D and jump over to Ngon which I'm already in to demonstrate in action the issue at hand. So basically you would draw a shape with Ngon and then when you use the draw dot to adjust it you lost your original proportions which drove me nuts. So by right clicking we can stop. I could even right click to continue undoing points in the event that I wanted to just redraw the shape altogether even from that 2D pause state just letting users know and now we have our secondary shape so if we click and drag this we're able to freely transform this which is great and even if we move it across the dot it still keeps pretty much the same shape as before except dragging it up and down does flip it it appears except it actually doesn't but if we hold shift we see that we're actually constrained to a box formation which is completely different than the shape that we originally drew so that's the issue that we aim to improve in this update so if we cancel that and just jump over into the new version of box cutter we can press d and jump over to ngon and let's just create our shape click on the last point to snap it to the first and from here if we grab the draw dot and we begin adjusting it like before we see that everything's fine but if we hold shift we see that we're now able to get the original proportions of this shape back so no matter how you scale it you can just hold shift in order to get your original proportions back depending on the type of result that you're going for so this is a pretty big fix for Ngon it always drove me crazy that we weren't able to get one-to-one -one exactly what we wanted whenever we were using the transformation dot